In Washington, under the intense scrutiny of House Republicans, an impeachment inquiry report was released against President Joe Biden, spotlighting alleged abuses of power connected to his son Hunter Biden's financial activities. On the first day of the Democratic National Convention, this 300-page document, while not attributing criminal misconduct directly to Biden, intensifies accusations of misusing the Biden brand for personal gain. Despite Biden's non-candidacy for re-election, the path forward remains nebulous, with the House GOP hesitant and the Senate distant. The White House rebuffs these claims as mere political stunts, urging a shift in focus. This report recapitulates ongoing Republican efforts, fueled by Trump's encouragement, to pin down Biden with charges paralleling those faced by Trump himself. Now, with the spotlight potentially moving to Vice President Kamala Harris, the GOP recalibrates its strategy amid diminishing inter-party support for Biden's impeachment. This unfolding saga continues to probe the depths of political alliances and enmities, as the Biden administration dismisses the inquiry as an obstructionist tactic by its opponents.